lean muscle mass. Build it fast with autophagy hacks. Dr. Mindy Peltz with Dr. Sean Baker. Here's how we look at fasting. When you want to heal your body, fasting is a, a, a go-to strategy, but it has to be paired with healthy eating. So when we go into autophagy, 17 hours of fasting and longer, what we're doing, autophagy is in opposition of a cellular mechanism called mTOR. mTOR will build cells up and make them healthy. They will build muscle. Uh, on the other end of that spectrum is autophagy. Autophagy will break down and heal so it can break muscle down, but it's temporary. It is not the, the whole picture. So if you want to build lean, strong muscle, the absolute best way to do this is to go 17 hours of fasting on a regular basis and then break your fast with protein and protein only. If you break your fast with protein, what you're now doing is you're saying to your cells, okay, we've stimulated autophagy, we've cleaned ourselves up, now let's build ourselves strong and let's go and add protein in to stimulate mTOR so we can build muscle up. Now, the next hack on this that's amazing is why don't you fast on a regular basis, 17 hours, do a strength training workout in a fasted state. So you're breaking muscle down even more and then have a big meat meal afterwards. Break that, like literally leave your workout and then go and eat a bunch of meat. And now you that is the greatest way to build muscle. So when people say it breaks down muscle, it's like, yes, in the fasted state temporarily but if we start adding in more protein and we break our fast with protein now you're building muscle better than you ever built it before if you take a bunch of people in a fasted state and you go well they broke muscle down and they lost muscle yeah of course of course that's your body's going to find glucose wherever it is it's going to go after it in the muscle it's going to go after it in your fat it's going to go after it in your liver and so it's going to break that down. Now, what are we doing after the fast? So the first thing that most people don't realize is you're stimulating autophagy every night when you go to sleep. So when you sleep, your, your brain actually goes into a repair mode. This is why sleep is so important. So make sure you're prioritizing sleep, make sure you're getting enough sleep because that's going to be a great way to stimulate autophagy. Then we throw in the 17 hour fast. And it, it, you know they say autophagy and fasting happens somewhere between 17 and 72 hours. So when people really want a deep cellular cleaning, that's part of why they go into those 72 hours. Fast. We've got uh, HIT training where you're getting your heart rate up and down, that can stimulate autophagy. We have things like red light therapy, some biohacks like red light can stimulate autophagy. Um, we've seen some you know, herbs that like bergamot that can stimulate autophagy. So it's not, you know, you start stacking those things together. If you, what I'm finding in my community is that a lot of people as they're starting to go, oh, like, I've been doing this all wrong. I've been eating wrong. I've been eating the wrong foods. I've been living wrong. And they start to wake up. Then what do they need to do to repair themselves? And the more we can start to stack autophagy habits to, and combine them, the quicker somebody is going to heal. Lean muscle mass. Build it fast with autophagy hacks. Dr. Mindy Peltz with Dr. Sean Baker. To be effective, fasting or eating in a compressed window must be paired with healthy eating. At 17 plus hours of fasting, autophagy begins, and so does mTOR, which is a cellular mechanism in opposition to autophagy. mTOR builds cells up, it builds muscle. Autophagy breaks down and heals the cell. Autophagy, breaking down muscle, is temporary. To build lean, strong muscle fast for 17 or more hours regularly and then break that fast with protein. Dr. Pelt says, we've stimulated autophagy, cleaned the self up. Now let's build back strong, stimulate mTOR to build muscle up. Building lean muscle mass regularly fast for 17 hours or more. Do strength training workout while fasting. Break muscle down and then eat meat. She says it's the greatest way to build muscle. 
people say, don't fast, it breaks down your muscle. But it's only temporary. Then eating protein, and especially animal-based protein, which is best, stimulates muscle development. People say, don't fast, it breaks down muscle. But that's only temporary. Then, by eating protein, and animal-based protein is best, that stimulates muscle development. Dr. Pelt says, the body will find glucose wherever, muscle, fat, liver. The key is, what do we do at the end of the fast? During sleep, we are also stimulating autophagy. The brain goes into repair mode, so get good sleep. Then get into the 17 plus hour fasting. The longer the fasting, the more cleaning. Stimulating autophagy, including HIT, high intensity interval training, red light therapy, or herbs like bergamot. She says, stack autophagy habits together for quicker healing. Annotated and summarized. Easy to share with loved ones. To view and print these summary notes, see the description below the video title. To view and keyword search this channel's hundreds of videos organized by topic and by doctor, go to doctorstotrust.com.